Hey guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to this channel. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please do me a favor, like, share and subscribe to help the channel. This is Canon Pexima TX3150. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, 3-in-1, in the sense you can copy, scan and print from this printer. This printer is very economical and affordable. This printer is very stylish and functional printer. You can hook this printer up using Wi-Fi network, Wi-Fi direct and with USB cable. Unfortunately, USB cable is not included in the packaging. We have this at Vinatex store, free delivery here in UK. This printer is compatible with Windows. It's also compatible with your Android and Apple phone. This printer, this is the scanner. It's flat bell scanner. You stick the document you want to copy or scan on top of the scanner and select the function from the corner here. Okay. And this printer is using N cartridges 546 color and 545 black. This printer is nice. It's built with your space in mind. It's very economical and affordable. This is the ink cartridge holder. This is where it is at the moment. Okay, once you load the ink, it will move away from the center there to the corner. Okay, if you haven't, if you got the printer without the packaging, okay, so there, there is a sticker on, inside it for you to know, okay, that will enable you to know the ink number, okay just gonna bring the camera for you to see some of the features of this printer and this is the on and off button for this printer this is the wi-fi button and this is the direct and this is the information button it will ask you to press this information button when you want to connect this printer to wi-fi network and you can see a light with E4. What this means is that uh, the ink cartridge so that the ink is not yet installed, and this button here is for you to change to specific paper. So you can change to A4 paper to B5 or A5. So you can change to specific paper by pressing this button, and once you select it, you select OK. And this button here is for you to cancel. This is for you to copy your document black, and this button here is for you to copy your document color okay now what i want to do is to show you how to install the ink cartridges or replace the ink if you like is what we are going to do and to do this to do this what you need to do is just open up the printer now you start from the black color this is the black ink cartridges okay. and just pull off be mindful of the chip in front of it so just just need to pull it off okay just pull off the plastic that cover the front of it okay where the ink goes then you go with then you look on the sticker so the black color goes to the to the right okay then you go in So this this end needs to go inside okay once it's inside push it upwards and it's in okay you need to do the same thing to the color Pull it off. Okay, then you go in. Okay, and this in. Now, if you want to remove this ink, you just need to press it down, press down, and remove it. Okay, the set. So this is how to replace it. The same thing is applicable. Just press it down and replace it. Okay, and once you're done, you just need to close it. You close it. Give this printer time to get ready
and the, the light that was here is off okay so the warning light is no longer there okay so if you look now i can see that the, the light that was here flashing is no longer here so we just need to wait for this printer to be ready and recognize the ink okay initially there was amber light here with error e4 so now we install the ink we just need to wait for this to to be ready and you can see the ink cartridges is installed and what is now doing is wi-fi light is flashing what that mean is it's because it's not yet connected you can see two line for the wi-fi is flashing okay but this is how to install the ink cartridges okay so this is how to install the ink now if you op if you open it up you can see it will come okay, so you can see it, the ink is right here waiting for you, you to change it so this is how it, it normally once you load the ink and want to change it you need to open it up and the ink cartridges holder will come right in the middle to change it okay so this is how to load the ink cartridges if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it help the channel thank you very much indeed and stay blessed